Welcome to another edition of Toolbox Tuesday. Today we're gonna focus on this rosebud brazing tip. There's a lot of different brazing tips on the market. Once we showed you the captain hook, that's a type of brazing tip. And this rosebud is another type. And each tip provides some different functionalities to it when brazing to hopefully make the brazing job easier. As always, when we braze, you wanna have a couple safety devices around. Make sure you have on eye protection. Make sure you wear gloves. A bucket of water just in case. You can also use some cool gel spray barrier to kind of help with the reduction of heat transfer when you're brazing. Make sure you prepare your copper properly, sand it. Make sure your joints are fitted and sanded and cleaned out and all ready to go. And even here, we don't have it hooked up, but we have a little apparatus in case we were in a braze with nitrogen. Whenever you braze, you should always braze with nitrogen to protect the insides of your copper tubing while you're brazing. Remember, our refrigerant has to pass through there, so we want those refrigerant lines in our line set to be as clean as possible. So let's take a look at this rosebud tip, do a little brazing with it and see how it works. This has got a pretty long flame on it, but that's okay. You can just adjust that to your preference. We're gonna heat up our joint. And remember, we wanna pull our, our seal foss into, into the joint that we're gonna brace. As that copper starts to heat up, we wanna make sure we get a nice, even heat all the way around it. But notice that that tip allows us to get hot pretty quick. And once we get that, we're just gonna kind of brush our, our seal foss on and move it around. And then of course, when we finish we want to check our joints to make sure um, that we don't have any leaks or anything like that. Again, that's the rosebud tip. Another tip that you can use for brazing. Very effective tool. Provides a lot of heat, covers a lot of area very quickly. Thank you for tuning in to another Toolbox Tuesday. We'll see you next time. Hey, we absolutely love our HVAC community. We want you to continue to tune in. We want you to continue to, to leave us your, your comments. Um, make sure you click below to subscribe. We definitely want to hear from you and we'll see you next time.